Welcome to the channel. Today we're going to be building a Brick Veteran kit. This is their rendition of the A10C 74th FS fighter aircraft. The kit number is BV10014 and it contains 1,564 pieces and was designed by Cody Cell. Looks like I have box number five. There you go. Let's go ahead and open it up and see what's inside. Oh no. Looks like one of the numbers came off the bag. Hopefully only one did. Looks like we have 10 bags of parts, if I counted that right, maybe 9. Here's the little certificate it comes with, showing I got kit number 5. Pretty cool that they include those. Here's the instruction manual. And here's a look at what the uh, instructions look like. Pretty clear, I like how they highlight in red about around the parts that you uh, place on the build. Let's see, there's some facts about the aircraft. Here's a look at the back of it. Let's get started with the build. Here's a look at the underside of the A-10 with the landing gear down. Pretty easy to put away. They just fold forward and tuck right in there. And the front one just tucks in like this. That goes over there. And then that covers the hole. You can see some of the printing on the underside. The stars and bars there. Some on the side of that. This guy has some on here. And then the sensor over there. You can also see your tail printing. Obviously the mouth. Let's go ahead and uh, flip it back over, put it on the stand, and uh, show you what it looks like with all of its flaps and everything open. 
Here's a quick look at the minifig included with this set. This one was designed by, I believe, Force Moon Bricks. So here's a side view of the A10C by Cody Ocell at Brick Veteran. Good angle to see all the prints. I do have all the flaps open and or any of the movable parts, I should say, including the cockpit. The front um, minigun here is a custom printed metal barrel, I believe. And the uh, minifig is by Force Moon Bricks. I'm going to go all the way around once so you can see all the different prints from this angle. Here's a look at it from a slightly higher angle, so you can see some of the printing on the top of it. I do really enjoy the way that uh, Cody made all of his lines, like using these tiles here to hide the uh, brick-built angles on the top part. Great print job on the canopy, mouthpiece, the custom barrel here. The new part that he used for the engine versus the uh, the old Brickmania one that had the uh, cement mixer drum, I believe it was. Overall, a great model, great kit. I would highly recommend it to anybody that's looking to get one. One of the other cool things is it does include the stand, and the stand is movable, so you can actually change the angle. And you can actually reverse the stand so it makes the uh, aircraft point nose down. You just have to pull it out and flip it around. If you guys enjoyed the video, please leave a like and subscribe. And as always, have a wonderful day.